We video marketers wanted to get traffic to our videos and get results as fast as possible. The problem today is that uh, there's a lot of different options that it really gets confusing if what will be the best option that we will go for. And when it comes to traffic, there's organic and there's paid ads. And under organic, you can get traffic organically from your social media followers or from SEO. And in video marketing, we all know that video SEO is one of the best way to do so, but you all know that ranking YouTube videos on YouTube and Google is no longer as easy as it once was. Not to mention when it comes to SEO, you know, uh, they change the rules each and every time. So even if you rank on page one, there's no guarantee that you will stay there forever. Plus a lot of other reasons why it's uh, not the best way to go for now. If you wanna get results fast, because of course you need to spend more time, uh, even some money before you can get more results. And when it comes to just relying on uh, social media followers, of course, if you have a big following on uh, your YouTube channel, wherein you have a lot of subscribers, that can uh, somewhat help. But a lot of us, especially in the marketing industry, does not have uh, that you know a luxury of having a lot of subscribers. And on Facebook, unlike some years ago, wherein if you have a lot of social media fans, then you can get a lot more organic traffic. Nowadays, even if you have a lot of likes on your Facebook page, their algorithm is designed in a way wherein you cannot still get more eyeballs from your post if you rely on organic traffic on your Facebook page. You need to pay for you to play, which we will get more into later on. Right now, I just want to make it clear that if you want to get video traffic fast, you cannot rely on organic traffic such as you know from your uh, social media followers or from video SEO. So now let's talk about doing paid ads instead and there's, there's a lot of options like you can run youtube ads video ads on facebook or in other social media places like twitter linkedin and even on tiktok although right now i, I want to focus more on youtube and facebook because uh, these are the proven platforms wherein uh, you can get results from running video ads and for me personally i'm not really using youtube ads Personally, I'm using YouTube for doing video SEO, although like I said, uh, you can't really rely on it if you want to get results fast. So what can you use if you want to get results fast? Well, there's no question that it will be Facebook video ad. And personally, I'm getting a lot of results from uh, Facebook video ads, and it's what I highly recommend because from there, you can control things. Unlike you know, video SEO, wherein even if you rank on page one, you're not really sure if uh, some days YouTube and Google will uh, you know shake their algorithm and you will lose your ranking again, or some competitors out there might outrank you and all that. Uh, when it comes to video ads, you can control things more. You can control the time, the location, and even uh, the people in your niche whom you can target and place your video ads in front of them. And it's a great way to test things as well. And if you find out that a certain video is not working well, you can simply uh, turn it off and you know, uh, just uh, make another video ad. And if your video ad is working well, again, uh, the, the good thing about it is that it's easy for you to scale things up by increasing your budget or even duplicating that campaign and also duplicate your results. Something that you cannot do in video SEO, right? Uh, for example, if your video is ranking on page one, you cannot duplicate that so that you will have two videos ranking on page one. But that's something that you can easily do in Facebook video ad. And there's a lot more reasons why, uh, but uh, those are the two big ones. Although again, like any other platforms, there's a lot of things that have changed since then in running your Facebook ads as well. And one recent change that is happening today is the way that iOS is no longer, you know, just having their uh, tracking automatically happening. They are making it in a way wherein you need to manually allow them to, you know, track your website traffic and all that. And of course, the best way to counter that problem is to rather use video ads. Because for video ads, once you accumulate views in your videos, you can easily retarget those viewers and you know offer your product or services and get results right away. But of course, there's a lot more details that we need to learn when it comes to running video ads successfully on Facebook. So if you want to learn more about doing this thing successfully, I'm inviting you to join us in our upcoming webinar. And you can just click the link in the very first comment on this video and uh, just sign up to that webinar. And uh, we will go more into the details on how to uh, run video ads successfully on Facebook today.